Hey guys, good afternoon. We've got uh, two events. We've got a flyover about to occur down on the Potomac by Arlington. And then I'm going to take you into the White House for an event for Toys for Tots, the U.S. Marine Corps' toys program. Should be kind of interesting. Let's go. Hey guys, good afternoon from the banks of the Potomac where it's really cold. I mean, the wind is whipping. I swear I saw some snow flurries earlier today. Listen, we're just going to hang down here because there is a Brigadier General or Major General of the U.S. Marine Corps who's being laid to rest right now. You hear the cannons every now and then. We're going to have a fly over in a minute, and then we're going to fly to the White House for Toys for Tots at the White House with the, Vice, uh, the First Lady. So it's going to be a busy, like, 25, 30 minutes right now. Let's get going. How are you, Andrew? Oh, just running around. Nice and cold. I, it wasn't. It was not cold when I left the house. And then, yeah. Okay. It's the Oval Office. I guess he's in there. And the Marines are all over here setting up. We can get some toys. Okay. So that's our setup. Toys for tots. Lots of rings. I'm gonna set a ladder up. Please copy that. Okay, so toys for tots, all set up, but now we're going down to the ice rink, which is back here somewhere. <laughs> oh wow, you can actually see the indentations of where Marine One lands. I'm literally standing where Marine One lands. We're not supposed to really walk here, but... Cool. There are like little markers there. Random cable. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's a giant marine bulldog mascot dude. And some of the families are coming out from the East Wing. All right, let's go. Where's our skates? How you doing? Hello. Hello. Happy holidays. Yeah, Let them pass. Sure. Thanks for having us. Go around back like the other time? Yeah. So for the unveiling, you guys can go around the back. What we're trying to do differently this time is kind of this L shape. So you can kind of go on this. On this side? This side of the back. All right. And on this side. Okay. Oh, these are nice. Wow. So there's the Zamboni. Uh, let's go find some pictures. I think this time I go up to the left this time, but. This will be fun. Oh. She's up there. So the 
first lady is right over there. We are not going that way. <laughs> well, the first lady is right over there. She's walking up to give this announcement. We're going to our press positions over here. I'm going to show you guys those landing zone things. Jackson. And now it is my great pleasure to introduce our host for this amazing event, the First Lady of the United States of America, Dr. Jill Biden. Thank you, Brigadier General Jackson, and uh, welcome to the White House. Good score. Mike, pretty good score. I mean, that's yeah. Can we walk by the Can we walk by the boxes? Sure. A lot of bicycles. I know. Some very generous people. <laughs> She left? I think she left. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. We are out. I think I heard Mariah Carey three times in like 20 minutes. Oh, go in the back door. Okay, back to ladder. Ladder row. The uh, motorcade just left, I think. All right, we have a full press briefing going on. I think Kirby is speaking. And uh, let me see. Yeah, Kirby's speaking right now. Let's go and take a couple of pictures of that. Then we can get out of here where it's warm. It's unacceptable. I mean, one of the things you, you, you all keep asking us, and rightly so, about the condition of these hostages, what we know about them. And the truth is we don't know a lot. And if we could get Red Cross access, and not only, would they have a measure of solace, which is the most important thing, that somebody knows where they are and cares about their condition, but it would help give us some information. I just was, uh, was told about the shooting. Obviously, we're going to continue to monitor uh, what's currently occurring. I don't want to get ahead of what the local enforcements are, are probably dealing with at this time. You heard me at the top talk about um, you know, another shooting that happened in Texas. And I'll certainly, um, uh, this is an epidemic that the president has taken very seriously. That's why he's taken actions. Hey okay, right. guys, so that is the Toys for Tots. Uh, they're active all over the country if you want to donate toys. Look up your Marine Corps Reserve. They're certainly taking toys. I'm going to get off the light. I'm going to get out of here because it's really cold, really cold. Uh, POTUS is away. He's at a conference. He's supposed to be coming back soon, but I'm just going to get out of here. Okay. Hmm. There was one. Am I gearing up for another one, maybe? No, we're stuck on the fence. Okay, guys, that was the Toys for Tots at the White House. Uh, tomorrow, Thursday, it's going to be cold. I have no idea what's going on at the White House. There's nothing on the schedule. But the Congress, the Congress might be kind of interesting. So maybe we'll go up to Capitol Hill. Maybe we'll go explore. Maybe we'll go find those donuts again. Yeah, it's been about, what? It's been about four or five days since we had donuts. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.